Hey yo, it's your boy H Freddy, and you guys will notice that this is not a live stream. This is an actual video. These uh, kind of videos have kind of been requested a lot, you know, not only by my friends but by, but by uh, some of you guys. So uh, we can go ahead and start doing this now. In my first episode of this Let's Play Minecraft series. I'm going to be showing you guys a tour of my city that I built with my cousin. Now, I don't know if he wants me to say his name or not, so at this point, you know, I'll just uh, not say his name. Unless he wants me to tell you guys later. But, yeah, uh, I just want to show you guys this tour. Uh, yeah, so as you guys will notice, uh, I'm going the wrong way. Uh, here's the start of my city, you know. Right now, uh, we basically have a miniature farm that I built. Um... Which is probably why it looks so trash. Um, I think right here, these are potatoes, uh, wheat, and we have some uh, pumpkins and some carrots. Um, yeah, this looks trash. We don't even really use the farm unless we're trying to like uh, breed some of our animals, but we don't really eat those. And then uh, right here, I got like a tree farm, which I also don't use. I like to go like farther off in the distance. So um, the name, we decided to name this city called Polis. The reason why we named it Polish was because uh, me and my cousin, uh, we both like to watch this show on Netflix called, called The 100. And it's pretty much like a survival show where, you know, people have to survive their time on Earth after like a while. And we kind of like the way that they were building their buildings, like half of it was destroyed and like ruins, you know what I mean? Uh, this is kind of where we got, uh, the, the idea to build this city. Oh yeah, by the way guys, uh, we haven't looked up any videos at all of how to, um, build anything. These all came from, like, straight up from our mind, which is why I like our, like, unique style. Because I've never seen anybody else build like this on my, uh, on, uh, Minecraft. So let's go ahead and open up one of the gates, and we can just walk through here. Yeah, close it back. Uh, like I said, we got a unique style. I like to incorporate, you know, different, um, stuff into the ground, like how we have, like, um, I forgot what this is called, but, like, the dirt block is pushed down, and then we add, like, other cool blocks and stuff like that. I just like the style. And we put a lot of red flowers and, you know, tall grass and regular grass in here, and I just like the unique style, because I haven't seen anybody do this before. Now, this right here is my house. This is actually the second one I've ever built. Well, on this world, uh, there's nothing much really going on in here. I just got two beds, you know, stuff and chests, pretty much. Uh, I kind of need to get organized, you know. Anything in here? No, we just got dirt. Oh, yeah, and, uh, I got red glass. Um, yeah. Now, I still want to finish our ho my house because it's kind of strange, you know. Now, before I go off this way, I want to go ahead and go up here. Oh, yeah, uh, right here we have, like, this strange, you know, uh, I don't, I wouldn't know what to call it, but it was like supposed to be like an archway. Uh, it's kind of strange looking, but it looks a lot better at night. Before I even go up there though, uh, I would like to show you guys the map. So, right now we are down here in this, uh, snow area. Uh, I have traveled two different maps, and they do like, uh, link over to each other. So, I actually spawned, uh, it was like on an island, I think it was right there. If you see like my cursor, you see the cursor, the, the plus. I spawned somewhere around here, and I started traveling up, and this is where I found the first village and the first, um, desert temple, which is up here, uh, so yeah, I pretty much went from all the way down here to all the way up here, and then I got kind of lost for a minute, and I ended up all the way down here, uh, where I am right now, and then, you know, I just, you know, went around. Now, there is another village, but it's all the way at the top, but there's nothing really there. It's just, like, two houses, so I don't really find a use for it. Eventually, we will travel up, and we will travel down, and, you know, just a little bit more. To, uh, now that we are going up, uh, right here, this was my first original house, and the reason why I came over here was because I found an igloo, which is why there's, uh, snow blocks up there. Now, I kind of got bored of this house after a while. Uh, this was pretty much the only thing that was over here besides the farm. It was pretty much just my house and the farm at first. Um, uh, yeah, there's not much in here anymore. You know, we just got a bunch of random stuff in here. There's not even any stuff in there. So I have a bed in here in case, you know, like other people come in here and play. Now down here is like a dungeon, I guess is what it would be called. 
down here, uh, we have a regular villager. Doesn't really trade for much. I mean, I guess I can get this for some rotten flesh. I'm definitely not doing that. And then we have a zombie who we want to convert into another uh, villager. Now, we did already create a villager before. Um, out of a zombie. Uh, I thought it was pretty cool. Yeah, there's not much in here. Sorry it's so loud. Now, I was hearing a bunch of that moaning stuff, but I knew it wasn't that one. Because I could hear a whole lot of them doing it. And we did find this uh, spider uh, spawner. Now, I could have sworn at first this was not a spider one. This was like a, a bone thug or a skeleton um, spawner down here. I guess it just changed, I guess. Now, over here, this is what my cousin built. This was based off of the show, uh, The 100. Uh, they had like a tall building and stuff. Uh, they had stuff. Now, I did move the villager, but the villager was right here. Uh, I'll show you guys later where he is. Um, but this is pretty much his own thing. Uh, he put a bunch, oh yeah, yeah. He put a bunch of the, the holes in here, so, um, uh, you know, make it look a little broken, I guess. I like the building. Now, I don't want to go on his stuff, because, you know, that's his stuff. Now, at first, he just kept killing himself, so I gave him the idea to, you know, put this down here. Now, over here, we have, um, our pig stable and our cow stable. Now, we don't even really use this a lot. We normally just go off and exploring and, you know, just kill some um, animals along the way. I do want to move these guys into, like, a bigger area where I could, uh, you know, actually farm them. Uh, but, yeah. Uh, over here, this was our first place. I don't use this anymore, but my cousin does. And, actually, we will need this for later. And, like I said, uh, to make it look like it was run down, broken, you know, ruined... Uh, we made sure that we incorporated, uh, you know, broken stuff. But I don't really come up here. It's just my cousin, really. I mainly come off this way where I'm normally at. Now, uh, one of the beginning things after I built my house in this archway, I decided to build, uh, this. Now, I'm not sure what these things are called, but they're pretty much, you just, they're like walkthroughs. And I really like it because I added a bunch of, like, flowers and tall grass and leaves and vines. And I just like how the way this looks, like. It just went off of like pure thought and I just built it. I really like it, especially at nighttime. Uh, like I said, sometimes I just like to build stuff just off of thought. Um, I didn't really think about what this was going to be used for. But it's just pretty much just like an octagon and it goes off into different pathways. Now, I did have some tall grass in here, but I didn't like it, like the way I designed it. I was going to put some chests in here, but no. Nah. Yeah, I have our, I'm completely not organized at all. Here go our horse stables. Uh, I don't remember which one was mine. I think it was the this one. This one was mine, and that one was my cousin's. Oh, I can't show you that. Guy. And this is pretty much just where we get our bunch of our uh, bread and materials and diorite and stuff like that in cobblestone. I haven't gave this part, like this di this district, um, a name yet. I haven't gave this place a name, and this is where you guys come in hand. Uh, what do you think I should name this district? This is pretty much like where all the workers are going to be at. But yeah, like I said, this was uh, this is our work district. Um, I only built one building so far, and this kind of reminds me of the Krusty Krab, just the way I built it. Um, but yeah, I, I put a nice feature into this that I haven't seen a lot of people do. Well, I don't really watch Minecraft videos, but you know, based off when I did used to watch it a lot, uh, I haven't seen many people do this. Now, this is our original uh, villager. Uh, the fisherman. Uh, we did trade a little bit with them. Uh, not a lot, though. Uh, we did start trading string and a little bit of coal, but not much. Really. Yeah. So, um, this is something cool that I built. Uh, like I said, I haven't looked it up. I just, you know, did it. I was trying to figure out a way to make this look nice, but I, I, I think it's alright. You know, everything don't have to be perfect. So what this is is you pretty much you just throw stuff in and it automatically cooks it. So it's pretty much an auto automatic um uh, and we have a bunch of food in here. You know, food. And this is where the raw stuff goes, but you know, we haven't had so much food yet to even do that. So yeah, this has been, you know, uh, our first episode. Uh, I hope you guys come back next time. Tell me uh, your thoughts and um, ideas of what we should do in this. Um, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.